Hi, I'm Starly Murray. I'm a television producer, an on-air personality, and on a hunt for amazing, rich, and rewarding content to share with our viewers. And today we have that. We have Pam Breedevelt. And Pam is a best-selling author, and she's also a consultant, and she helps people to get through the pain of loss. And Pam, you have a, an amazing and a very touching backstory on this and, I, and if you don't mind could you please share with our viewers this heart-touching story as well as some of the uh, solutions in the beautiful place that you are now. Thank you Starly. A number of years ago I walked into my doctor's office halfway through the pregnancy yeah. and found out that the baby had just died. It was uh, no longer viable and so then a number of years later our 16 year old son was hit by a car and also relocated to heaven. And so I know that kind of pain, and I don't want women to suffer in silence. Well, um, thank you um, for the gifts that you're sharing to help people through this. And I know that the gifts that you have also include very specific tools. Um, I, I've been researching you, Pam, and I know of at least five, but could you share three of them today with our viewers? You bet, and what I love about these is that the brain science research absolutely backs all of these up. One is to listen to your heart, because feeling is healing. Birds fly, fish swim, people feel. Yeah. Feeling is healing. Yeah. And when we derail the healing by stuffing and numbing, it's no good. Gotcha. Secondly, we want to look for the good, because there's good around us every day and grief pulls us into that black vortex of negativity. So we need to provide ourselves with grief relief by looking for the good intentionally. And finally, we gotta lighten our load because grief is hard work. We cannot have the same expectations on ourselves as usual. Well, Pam, I mean, these are tools that are, I feel are very actionable and that our, our viewers at home that are feeling loss or pain, that they can start to apply these um, immediately. And let me ask you, I mean, this is, this is a, a lot that you have done to help people. What motivated you to really do this and start this journey of uh, helping? I don't want people alone suffering in silence. Well, I mean, uh, well said and well, well felt from your heart. And what about people who have... Uh, uh, who are listening today and they want to go that next step, how would they get in touch with you or how do they begin a process of healing? They can go to my website, pamvredevelt.com, click on Empty Arms and they'll have the resources right there. Pam, beautiful. Thank you so much for not only sharing your beautiful and touching story, but for all that you do to help others who are going through loss and um, need your help and your resources. Uh, we appreciate you so much. Thank you, Starly. It's good to see you again.